going down for real. I'm Alyssa Buckner. I'm the senior class president at Dade County Hospital, and I'm here to tell you about some of our CTAE classes and the pathways that you can take. But instead of boring you with words about it, I'll just let you watch this video. The pathways offered at DCHS are administrative and informational support, audiovisual technology and film, formerly known as broadcasting, engineering, nursing, medical services, nutrition and food sciences, carpentry, electrical, and metal technologies. In the Administrative Informational Support Pathway, you have many opportunities. Uh, we work on resumes, applying for jobs. You work in Microsoft Word, Microsoft Publisher, Microsoft Access. You have the opportunity to get Microsoft Certified, which is wonderful um, in many of the Georgia schools that counts as a college credit for you. The Future Business Leaders of America is the club that I sponsor here at Dade County High School. We have a very active chapter to where we have close to 100 members. There are many conferences that you can attend. We have Region Leadership Conference, which is hosted at Ringo High School. We have State Leadership Conference at the Hot Regency in Atlanta, Georgia, and then if you're lucky enough to make it to Nationals, you get to travel somewhere fabulous like California, uh, New York, Chicago. My name is Hannah Moore and I'm the Vice President at FBLA, and at FBLA we do volunteer activities. The most recent one was when I went to Davis Elementary and served Thanksgiving lunch for kids and their families. Sorry, I was just watching some funny animal vines. Hang on just a second. So, I'm the broadcasting teacher, and in broadcasting we do cool things like make commercials, movie trailers, music videos. We also have a television station that comes out of the high school. And we have live events, short films, several video competitions through TSA and Skills USA, and highlight videos for the sports teams here at the high school. Hi, I'm Fletcher Keaton, and I'm a third year student in Coach Earth's broadcasting class here at the high school. Uh, in broadcasting, you learn how to use cameras, uh, the large Sonys we use to film the football games, DSLRs such as the Canon 70D. Uh, you learn how to light things to make them look all right. You know? uh, learn how to shoot on the green screen. We do all kinds of projects. Uh, it's just really fun. You'll have a good time in here. Uh, I'm Mr. Wilson. I'm the engineer teacher here at Day County High School. And uh, with the program, we like to uh, get involved in the, the engineering disciplines. And we like to design and build certain certain things, with, such as uh, solar power cars, um, CO2 dragsters, uh, balsa bridges, and um, also the uh, balsa airplanes. And uh, we're involved with TSA, which is Technology Student Association, and we do like to compete in that with, with those certain projects. We do have the, um, the Balsa Bridge project as well as the CO2 that we're going to compete in March uh, at the state competition in Athens, Georgia. So we're going to have a, a good bit of students going down there uh, uh, for a few days to compete in those uh, particular challenges. And uh, we also are competing in the web development and the video game design as well. Hi, I'm Kyle Suter. This is engineering. I'm in my third year. Uh, right now we get a uh, kind of pick, it, uh, pick your own and do it yourself project. I'm currently developing my own video game, similar to Super Smash Bros. Melee for the Nintendo GameCube. Hello, my name is Mrs. Clark and I teach the healthcare science pathway. Um, there's three classes that you take with me. The first class is introduction to healthcare science and you just learn the basics of healthcare and then you take essentials of healthcare which you learn the anatomy and physiology of the body. And then the last year, the allied health and medicine, you actually get to go out and do rotations in the healthcare um, field. And now I'm gonna let you talk to one of my essential students and so she can explain a little bit more about what we do in this class. In healthcare science, you learn a variety of things from basic human interactions to the muscle system and stuff like that. It's such a fun class if you're going to be a doctor or any field in the healthcare industry. I highly recommend it. Hi, 
my name is Savannah Madison. I am the family consumer science teacher here at Dade County High School. I teach nutrition uh, through the lifespan as well as physical wellness. And the last, pa the last part of that is uh, food science. Okay, it's a three course pathway. And um, we do everything from learning about nutrition and different foods to being well as a person. And a favorite part that everybody enjoys is cooking. So when you cook, it obviously means that you're eating. So that tends to be the favorite part of this class. FCCLA stands for Family, Career, Community, Leaders of America, and with FCCLA we get the opportunity to go and serve people, like we went to Dade and we served Thanksgiving dinner, and then we went to Davis and served Christmas dinner, and also with FCCLA you can go and compete in competitions, you can have a variety of topics such as foods and business and family, and it's also a great opportunity to go and meet new people, either in career fields or in the school. So in food and nutritional wellness, we learn about pretty much the basics of cooking. We learn about how to measure the right portions, all that good stuff. And then in Food for Life, we learn about the medical benefits for pregnant women, elderly, and children. And we learn about the causes food has for pregnant women. And then in food science, we learn about more like the chemical aspect of food and how all of it combines together, sort of. Okay, I'm Coach Wales, teacher of a uh, construction teacher here at Dade County High School, also a medals teacher. Uh, looking forward to having some of y'all take my class next year, maybe on down the road. But we want to make sure that we come in with a good attitude and, and ready to work when we get here. Our program that, uh, that y'all will be involved in will be occupational safety, and from there it'll move on to other uh, classes uh, as we go on. But in occupational safety, you'll work hard on safety, construction math, hand tools, power tools such as that. We make it a lot of fun, but we demand a lot of work. Uh, we want you to uh, take more than just uh, uh, the skills that we teach you. We want uh, to do, you know, uh, work hard on the soft skills as far as yes, no, please, and things, and, uh, and things such as that. So we want to have, I guess our main goal down here is to have a positive influence on you in your life. I'm Gabe Buchanan. This coach with us construction clients. We build all kinds of stuff. We've been working on picnic tables and stuff like that. He's coaches, guys. My name is Josh Boyson. I'm the Ag Education teacher here at Dade County. We have a couple different classes that we offer through Ag Education. The first one for most either uh, freshman, sophomore level classes uh, will begin with basic agriculture, uh, which kind of dabbles and gives you a broad understanding of what um, the world of agriculture has to offer. Uh, we'll talk about everything from plant science to animal science careers in agriculture, biotechnology. Uh, once you've uh, taken basic agriculture, you can expand your ag education into either animal science, plant science, ag mechanics, um, and eventually we'll add a agribusiness leadership class. You should join ag because we learn about cool stuff about plants and sometimes we get to go outside and do good stuff for the environment. And it also has this really cool club called FFA. It's going down for it.